What's up, YouTube? Here we go with Cincinnati once again. And here we're today, today we're here to talk about stair-stepping your way to your EDC greatness. And what I got here for you is a collection of three select blades that will stair-step you up into EDC greatness. Starting out with the CJRB Riff. Now the model I have is G10, the G10 handles with the AARPM9 uh, steel. And uh, I know this is reaching back as far as when this blade was made, as all, all these blades are not new. But for anyone who may be uh, newer to the EDC hobby, these are great blades to uh, collect and carry. Now the CJRB Riff is, as you can see, a button lock knife. It's got a flipper. It's got the deployment uh, fuller right there on both sides. And I think I can get it from both sides, yeah. You can get it from both sides. Got a little bounce out on it. But with practice, I'm out of practice because I don't carry this as much anymore. But with practice, you can get it down packed. As you can see, it's a very clean design. And it's a stout a stout uh, stout design also it's not a skinny little slicer it is a good slicer but it's not a skinny knife it's a good user knife I mean look at that that blade thickness I'll pull out some comparisons here in a little bit if I can grab some quickly I'll pull out some comparisons in a little bit so you can see what these look like next to uh, other knives That's the CJRB Riff right there. And that's on Amazon right now. That's priced at about $41.99. So that's a, that's a good takeoff point, a good starting point. And right here is the uh, Sin Cut, which is also CJRB, if uh, anyone doesn't know. This is CJRB's budget line. Or, I'm sorry, not CJRB, Civivi's and Wii's budget line. My mistake on that. But as you can see, this is an aluminum handle with 10CR steel? I can't remember actually. See if I can get it in there. I don't think it's D2. If anybody can see that, can you tell me what, it, <laughs> what I'm looking at? Oh my goodness. I can't believe I, I forgot what it is. But it's a great steel. It's always held up very well for me. Um, it's not... I, I haven't heavily used this knife. But uh, it, it always... Uh, came to good use and strapped back very nicely for me and as you can see it's also uh, a button lock knife and we have the uh, flipper deployment thumb stud deployment and the reverse works well with the thumb, thumb stud also and the Sin Cut Serene is listed on Amazon for $46.75 so it's just one stair step up from the CJRB. But here we take a kind of a giant leap up to the uh, Wii Big Banter. Now the Wii Big Banter does take quite a leap and it's pretty much deserve it because of its uh, 
its structure and its, its history and the uh, the elements that, that, that have come together to make it happen. Now, the Wii Big Banner is also G10. We have that famous Wii design and quality. But we have an S35VN blade steel, which uh, does make quite a difference. And that accounts for the price difference between the Serene and the CJRB Riff. So you can understand why it's so much more. Now with the with the uh, wee big banner, I love that finger twirl. Look at that. The big banner. It may not seem as quite as big as a, a bigger blade. As it actually is, because of the troil. But as you can see, it's quite, quite a, a big knife. It's not a full size. It's a step above full size. It's a big knife. These are full size knives. This is a big knife. I have uh, XL to two XL hands, and this fits my hand perfectly. It's almost like a needle in my hand, as a matter of fact. Has false shed action. And let me get some comparisons out here for you. And my first one I'm sorry guys, I'm sorry to take it so long. First one is gonna be the uh Spider Co Para three. Let's see how that sizes up next to all of these guys. And that, that's one thing I will say about the uh, the CJRB riff. The detent is a little weak. It's a little bit weak. It doesn't give you that pop like you want it. And for other comparisons. Let's see. What do I got here? How about I give you the Kaiser Veritas as another comparison. And just because I don't like to do what's normal, the Wii Roxy 3. I'll check that out. Now, the reason I named this a stair step video is because it shows you how you can go up in value in price. You can go up in price and in value for your knife collection. The CJRB Riff is $41.99. The Syncut Serene is $46.75. And the Wee Big Banter is $147.50. And those are Amazon prices, guys. I don't tend to flip around on lots of uh, different websites and try to get lots of different prices. Perhaps in the future I will. But for right now, I tend to shop where most people shop is on Amazon, but I do shop on White Mountain Knives, actually quite often, because uh, we can always sell our way there, can't we?
don't forget guys I'm still a budget I'm still a budget man so I hang in that range but yeah this is just to show you guys how you can stair step your way up to um, from uh, a mid-range priced good user knife which these are both these kind of both hang in the same range to me the Rift and the Serene and the 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 Wii Big Banter is kind of a big step up and I mean kind of for what for what you what you get kind of a, a giant leap because it is still G10 but for 147 I think you're doing pretty good but anyway guys let me know what you think and uh, like comment and subscribe and just uh, tell me what you thought of the video and what you would choose as your first or your last. Okay. In the immortal words of Bruce Lee, be like water, my friends. Peace.